Hey everybody, thanks for watching. My name's Kevin and I'm with All Star Medical. And uh, today we're gonna go uh, and talk about the, one of the most common questions we get when it comes to patient lists and it comes that, uh, down to the sling and how to handle that. Um, a lot of people don't realize how to put the sling on. So we get a lot of calls going, hey, I've got this lift. Don't understand um, how the sling works. So we're gonna show you that today. Um, for those of you that don't know, this is a patient lift. They make them electric and manual. This is a device that allows you to take somebody out of a chair, wheelchair, put them in a bed or another chair, it lifts them up, and basically in a hammocking effect, uh, you're able to move them around. So this is the sling, um, and they make different versions of them. They make this full sling, full body sling here. They make them with where they wrap around individual legs. They make them with a commode cutout, and they make sizes. So you've got a couple different options depending on what you're looking for. But when it comes to actually mounting it to the actual sling, most of your um, slings are color coded. If they're not, it's just basically different levels, like one, two, three, and four, and so on. And so what we always tell people to do is when you're mounting it on, to the lift, you want to put the same color like I have here. I'm both on yellow and yellow. All right, so I want to make sure that I have yellow and yellow on the back so it's balanced. And on the front, I went and went even longer and done the green one. Okay, and the reason I've done that is I want to be able to, when the person is sitting there, have their legs a little bit lower. Okay. And so this will give a effect of a person sitting in it like this, okay? On the back side, you typically have handles. This gives you the ability to pull somebody back and set them into the, like a wheelchair or a chair or in a bed or whatever it may be. That's what these handles are for. And you can also raise them up a little bit because there's some pivoting that your, your, your actual mount's going to, to do. You can turn it and adjust it accordingly. It can also be raised up and down. Um, so keep that in mind when you're putting that sling on. Um, the other thing is you may have to go a little higher than you want to based on the bed or the chair that you're dealing with. If the bed is height adjustable, you may not have to do as much play with this. Uh, you, you may be able to get your patient lift high enough to where it will go and you can easily slide the individual over on the bed. In some cases, you may be dealing with a bed at home, a regular type bed that doesn't have any height adjustability and you're gonna have to adjust these slings accordingly. So, you know, the biggest thing is making sure that the patient is actually comfortable in this sling. So, if you have questions, please comment below. Um, we can send you links and things like that that will show you different options on the slings. Um, but we wanted to just put something out there to show you how easy it is to, to put this on. Uh, again, they're super easy. So all you're doing is just taking it on and off just like this. They can be washed, so you can put this in a wash and you can dry them, things like that. But getting the right size and the right type it, it is pretty key. Um, and just, you know, making sure you've got it mounted correctly on the front and back to the right size. Other than that, it's pretty basic, but I hope this information helps you. Um, please um, subscribe to our page if you get an opportunity. You can check our information out at allstarmedicalllc.com, and you can also give us a call at 615-730-9438. Thanks.